This is Dr. Dan Diaco Esquire, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the Bubba Army YouTube channel. Howard was talking about us on, uh, on his show, I think Friday. I didn't no, hear that clip No, yet. it wasn't Friday. He did it Tuesday and Wednesday. Yep. Oh, but two days? Two days, two yeah, days yeah. Two days. Really? Well, yep. I, he was one of the, the the many that reached out. Aww. Oh, man. I had so many people reach out. You wouldn't believe. I had Opie from Opie and Anthony. Wow. Um, Mark from OAR. Oh, nice. Uh, Lisa Lampanelli. Really? Yeah. Wow. She's a heavy Ron, hitter. Ronnie Limp for Limo Driver. What? Dion. Oh, that's cool. Tony Stewart. Really? Rico Abre Abreu and Fathead Rico. Um, Has John Ronnie talked about his plans? Who? Ronnie. Because I, I noticed that he just put his house for sale. Yeah, he talked about it on... Yeah, he's going to move to Vegas. Oh, yeah, okay. He's waiting for his house to be done in July. Um, Billy Corbin. Uh, John Morgan. Billy Corbin, is that the guy from the Smashing Bumpkins? No. No. That's <laughs> a, document, a documentary. Don't laugh at me. The guy, the guy, that would have been killer, too. The guy, that did, the guy that did Cocaine Cowboys and The U and Busted. I don't know any of He's a, he's a documentarian. He's he's a, you, you should know him. He does some great stuff. He's a, yeah, he's great a, stuff. Sorry. Go ahead. Uh, Shannon Burke, all the JVC homies. Lisa from JVC sent me a bunch of lotto tickets and nudes. Ooh, ooh nudes. Nice. Oh, wow. Uh, Dr. McSherry, Gail Guayardo, Howard, wow. Howard uh, Mark McGrath. Uh, so you know a lot of a lot that of the these motorcycle guy. No, that's, <laughs> it's the uh, what is it, Sugar Ray guy? Yeah, yeah. He's, yeah. oh really? The spiky hair, frosted really? tips. Yeah, frosted yeah. tips. <laughs> I just want to fly. Yeah. Uh, fly. So a, a lot of those people heard it from Howard. That's incredible. And man. so they all reached out, and so this is what. And so Howard and I emailed a couple times back and forth. Oh, I wish Dr. Dan was here. Why? Oh, yeah. <laughs> does he, does he rap Dr. Dan? Yeah, he does. We, should, yeah, we <laughs> might want to save this till tomorrow. Oh, he what? I want to hear it. He no. Was Dr. no, 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 no. I want to play it now okay. because Dan confessed her on it all day. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, Right, Jay? Oh, my God, He'll yes. Have, it'll, we'll have it boiled up. He's so listening here, right now. He's on the way to the exactly. office. Exactly. I wrote uh, Bubba yesterday because we got a report that Bubba the Love Sponge, who's a friend of our show, that his whole team came down with COVID. Isn't that cool that Howard oh, recognizes this so as such? Rad. I mean, Blitz, I don't know that he recognizes too many. No. Like, that's kind of his thing is he thinks everybody sucks. And he said your whole show. Yeah. And um, I wrote him. I go, Bubba, is it a bit? Or he goes, unfortunately, not a bit. I am really sick. He explained to me in this email that he had it, tested positive. He was doing, you know, okay. But then he took another test and he tested negative, <laughs> which, is tr which is true. <laughs> it is shows true. you that even the tests are not great. And so with that, he went on the air to do the show. Mistake ever. <laughs> and he said he felt horrible. He had a 103.5 degree, 103 degree fever for an adult. That's very high. That's very high, yes. And so like my mom, <laughs> he's right. wearing me out. You know, Bubba, he's a workaholic, but he could not get through the show. He was having a really, really hard time. And he said, I don't know. I might have to go to the hospital. True, all true. You know, and Robin and I both agree. Bubba always struck us as a very cautious type. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, really? Take <laughs> Oh. Precautions, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Howard always got to get that little gimmick in there, doesn't he? God love you, buddy. Yeah, but, you know, the, the, it, very responsible, uh, you know, kind of. They're so good together, yeah, aren't they? Are. they? God, are. they would dance well. But anyway, it felt never horrible. Never do anything dangerous, yeah. So then I think Howard breaks up, break, broke down a clip. I'll give you a little tape of what happened on his show. I mean, you, I mean, a lot of, no wonder they hate us. Nobody gets play-by-play, -play, you know, account. Uh, uh, you know, nobody gets armchair quarterbacked on the uh, on the Howard Stern show, right? Nope. Nobody gets this. You want to hear it? Here's Bubba going down for the count. This is uh, the beginning of the show. <laughs> this will be what goes viral. Bubba goes down. Happy what? Happy Tuesday. Oh, it's so cool. <laughs> Tuesday can suck my... <laughs> So this is Howard playing our show yeah, that's me from you're last talking Tuesday. <laughs> Stuff me. If I'm Scott Greasy, I'm like, I'm signing that guy up again, man. He's pretty good. I wonder what Howard thinks of us. <laughs> I think he thinks we're like some monkeys. I think I'm just going to play music all day today. <laughs> <laughs> Feels good. I'm just... I'm just 
I, I, I don't look like Bubba. I don't feel like Bubba. I'm not Bubba. <laughs> I'm not myself. I am. <clears throat> oh, what is what is transpired? You sound normal. I don't get it. You sound great, Bubba. <laughs> you look great. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it through today's show or not. Oh, yeah, you can, man. You're Dan, a gorilla. Dan, you just shut up, okay? <laughs> it seems like the one side effect I have from COVID is in the morning when I wake up, I go through like an hour. By the way, this, is not, this isn't this is me playing myself. This, this is, is Howard. Howard playing myself. Yeah. Or two of That's an incredible. excruciating headache with an unbelievable temperature. And you can see he sounds, you know, it doesn't sound like Bubba. Now, do the <laughs> others have COVID while they're sitting there talking to a um, man suffering from COVID? <laughs> yeah, I yes. believe so. I mean, again, <laughs> yeah, that's uh, what you I, know, for sure. I don't know what really went on, but I think they all tested. Bubba tested positive for COVID last Wednesday. A couple of his other staffers <laughs> also tested positive, but his last test was negative, which was confusing. Because he was feeling worse. They're breaking. I mean, I mean, you can <laughs> say what you you can say what you want so about our cool. show, but we got the king of all media busting our show right on down to zero. And he yeah. got it all correct. Well, I mean, Anna, that borderline <laughs> whacks you out. Oh, I'm it? super whacked out. So it right shows now. you that they, you know, even with these tests, they don't know because here, yeah, but listen. you have to go by how you feel. So you don't go back to work if you're feeling <laughs> symptomatic. I know, Robin. That's, that's what Bubba. the responsible person thinks. <laughs> Bubba said his temperature was. Uh, but Robin, you don't have to worry. I got to get the units out. This is like a used car salesman. There's probably got a lot of guys working used car lots right now. Their phones feeling so good. But if you don't get the units burning gas down the road, <laughs> bitch, you ain't got no money to feed the family. A hundred three point two, and he had trouble thinking straight. Um, Blitz is <laughs> I had trouble thinking straight. Well, I think uh, that's all. Rounded up, it's just a day. Or, um, caveman, uh, possibly getting some stuff in case I can't make it. Um, because I just feel like absolute crap. But we gotta get we you know we got we gotta come to a show. We don't have a you know like a sick pay or you yeah. know we're like used car salesmen. If we're if we're not if we're not slinging units, we're not getting paid. Right. So we're out here trying to sling some units, even though we got full blown walking pneumonia with a COVID chaser. <laughs> <laughs> full blown walking pneumonia with a COVID chaser. Now, what do you think these upper echelon New Yorkers think about us? That we're just some absolute hill jacks? We're white trash. <laughs> Dan, how, when do you think I'll be out of the woods, Woods? No, a day or two. You think by the weekend? I'll be oh, out. yeah, you'll be fine by the weekend. Oh, you know how it's going to be. Howard's going to be. Howard's going to just wait. Oh, yeah, just wait. Oh, yeah, just wait. I mean, you're negative. This is one of his guys so on you the show he's it. asking. Boy, it's just, it doesn't feel like I got mud on your shoes, that's all. It doesn't feel like I got past it. Th that's his doctor. His doctor. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's JD. JD. That's JD. Yeah. That's like the butt head of the show. Yeah. Uh, that's his so, doctor. So, so this is what Wednesday. So Tuesday, JD was actually watching us on Twitch. Yeah. Because he chimed in to Howard and said, "Hey, I'm watching him on Twitch, and he's like leaving and not doing. You know." <laughs> he was so JD in. was giving a on air live play by play yes. as it was happening because he was watching us on Twitch. Correct. Yeah. What's up, JD? That's <laughs> awesome. I, that's that is very very cool. <laughs> Good morning, Miss Hunter. My name is Kenneth. Oh, oh that's, 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 that's that's not Howard. Oh, that blows no. Howard out of water. Stand by. <laughs> oh, Yaka. oh, that's a doctor. <laughs> yeah. Doctor he's who? sitting in the room with them. Uh, yeah. Dr. Diaco. Ah! Uh, Dr. Diaco said that already. Yes. Well, Bubba, meanwhile, Bubba's sitting there with a um, nebulizer, which is to open <laughs> up his lungs. He had some kind of vapor going on. And uh, here's how uh, he ended the show. He had to get off the air. I'm not thinking clearly, Dan, obviously. <laughs> 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 if I was serious asking Blitz, I couldn't I sign this show fast enough. I you know, know what I'm saying? Okay, well, can, you hear, can you hear the uh, nebulizer back there? Yeah, I hear that. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nebulizer. I'm not thinking clearly, Dan, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, we can, we, we can revisit this in a couple of days. Since, yeah. You know. We got a couple of weeks. I told Steven not to bother Did coming tonight. Did you say we got a couple of weeks? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, because I'm, yeah. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm actually out of here right now. <laughs> I feel as if we have some real fancy people looking at us and we're a bunch of lab rats. They're just looking at us. The way we act and talk and mingle. We're just, you know what? We're just lab rats. We're radio lab rats. How's it making you feel right now with the uh, nebulizer? Do you feel relieved that you have the therapy now? Well, I know that I can, <coughs> I can, I can breathe deeper and it still hurts. <laughs> but if I hadn't gotten this, it would have continued to hurt more. You know what I'm saying? This keeps, this kind of keeps me clear, right? Yeah. And also you, you, you won't have a fever in an hour. 
Oh, this will help me with my fever? Oh, yeah. That's one of the reasons you got the fevers today. Oh, yeah. I still think the best part was right before they got it working, when they couldn't get it working, and you're holding the broken one in your hand, <laughs> and you're like, you're literally like a half a second from rifling it against a wall and just getting up and walking oh, yeah. out. And I had that thought process in my head, you can throw this and feel better immediately. I could tell. <laughs> Or you could just try to hold on. Oh, but what you can't see is how far everyone is from Bubba. Yeah. Bubba right. is 25 feet from all of us. Well, mm -hmm. Who okay. cares? You stop the steroids. <laughs> okay. I got, uh, by the way, my COVID's turned into a sinus infection. I got that green. Oh. Ew. Like, it's not. Like that green algae smell in your mouth. Ew. Mine turned into <laughs> monster energy. Wait. <laughs> now, right. well, listen, do um, I don't know when we're going to be back. I really don't. But uh, <laughs> we'll keep you posted. By the way, this is how everyone will sound in the future on portable ventilators. That's my prediction. <laughs> That's so funny. By the way, one thing I do know from listening to those clips, everyone's on, everyone on Bubba's shows is a know-it-all. Like, it seems like this Dr. 50 Cent, Dr. This one, Dr. Everyone's giving him advice. Dr. 50 Cent. <laughs> what do you call Dan? You said he's a $36 million man. Yeah, Dr. 50 Cent. <laughs> he went, man, that's, a, that's a lot of value, man. That's a bad stock a right bad there. Day from 30, Bitcoin. If you went from 30, say, if you had something that was worth $36 million on one day and it was worth 50 cents the next, that's a. That's, that's called a, the Sunshine Skyway it, Bridge it, trip right there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and everybody's anyway. got it. They weren't smart enough not to get it, but they know what to do now. Well, thank God when I was talking to Bubba, uh, he, you know, when I was emailing him, he said he was thinking going to the hospital, which I hope he did because. Why not? Well, it sounds like he was on a steroid medication, which would have been helpful, but he stopped it. Because mm -hmm. I think... Cause She's smart. I'll tell you, Robin's smart. He She's tested negative and he thought it was over, but I think the test may have been poor. Exactly. You know, who knows? I don't know what's going on down there, but I, I wish him well and I hope he's okay. Well, we don't either. <laughs> we don't know what's going on down here either. But we're trying to get through it.